Hello everybody and welcome to Undead Champions game number um, 19 I believe and we have a smooth 500 TV difference which is alright isn't it um, yeah game number 19 15 wins 3 losses pretty amazing team and we've been drawn against a starting human team so you know I mean it, to be fair Humans are one of the best teams to be 500 TV down because he's going to get um, a wizard and Griff, isn't he? Which is going to give him a bit of a shot. So, yeah, he's he's going to have wizard and um, fine. <laughs> he's fine if you play rookie hum humans. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's all right, isn't it? Um, but he's he, wizard and Griff is going to be problematic, isn't it? Um, the good thing is I do have two tackle pommers to take care of Griff, so it's easy, he, or he might just concede as well if he if his team gets knack if he gets banged on if he just gets banged on he's got he's got to go Griff hasn't he I think it doesn't make sense to go anything else really fashion sniper count. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anyone would, would would purposefully snipe 500 TV down. <laughs> oh god, here we go, RNG god. Sexy. <laughs> that was pretty good. Wow, he used all his money as well. That's a pretty great thing. That should be my, my Nurgle sound, shouldn't it? <laughs> Holy shit. Um, no, so he even used his money as well. Yeah, exactly, Cake of Death. I think staying below fifteen hundred is a, is a good, is best practice on this ladder, so make sure you can get those rookie matchups. Um. <laughs> yeah, Griff is Griff is. Um, I uh, do you know what I did a human guide and then fucking forgot to transition into the star players. So, um, unfortunately, I've got to redo my human guide because obviously Griff is Griff. And even Zug's a really good star. I'm just going to receive, even though he's got the wizard, just so I can bang him. Oh, wow. Hey there, start playing when Blood Bowl 2 came out and learned a lot from watching your stream on YouTube. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that lovely? Though well, the five hundred TV could be a factor. Wow, isn't that cool? <laughs> this guy is glorious. <laughs> yeah, start playing. Learned a lot from it. Isn't that good? That's fucking. I, I do. I do. I do. I do love that kind of thing. Not gonna lie. Somebody commented on the uh, on the ducky match as well, saying they've learned a lot, and it it does make me feel good. That's what I want, you know. I want. That's why I did it. It was pretty cool. After letting win, not not a fucking no chance in hell. Um, of that, but. Um, <laughs> right. Why have I got this one here instead of this lineman? Right, I've got a couple. So the, by doing this way, he gets. I want to make it three dice, don't I? He gets a three dice, and then he gets a three dice, and then he gets a two dice or something. Jump up there so he's more protected. <laughs> I hope BLGF catches on like Gulf and Hoof did. It would be pretty good, wouldn't it? As high as possible for the inevitable turn on mummy death, yeah. Yeah, quad skulls into mummy death would be um 
would be inglorious. <laughs> yeah, I do, I do VIP jam toast, you correct. Yeah, it is, it is a nice ball, isn't it? Um, I love your balls. Live in Japan, thought I'd have one more game before I go to bed, can <laughs> Right, pretty cool. That sounds not like what I meant it to be, but no mind. No. Right, let's get him. Oh well. Inevitable. One, two, three, four, five, and then the sixth one there. Go for the blitz. I guess I could have tried to make it three dice, but it'd been tough, wouldn't it? I needed four, four assists. Got him. Obviously, going to pile on now. It's like an extreme blowjob, that isn't it? Pretty cool, Raven Pro, isn't it? <laughs> You've been trying to. Play. Um, Twenty AV breaks and thirty pals. It's pretty bad steel wrap. Pretty bad. That happens though, doesn't it? That happens. That um, that that happens. You should invite me to say just Patreon. Yeah, the ball is cool. I do like the ball. Do they actually have it in their hand when they pick it up? Yeah, they do. But he's gonna he's gonna bang on my goal by the looks of it. He's got Griff, yeah. Obviously, I've got to get tackle pom on Griff if I can, don't I? That is that is absolute priority number one is to tackle pom the fuck out of um thing. This isn't this match isn't actually Oka Cola. Oka Cola is um is on when it says it is. Um But yeah, Oka Cola has run forever, yeah. Um Unfortunately the the, the this Oka Cola thing I missed the first five games, which means I've been banged on in terms of ability to ever be competitive. It's going to take me like 40 fucking games to be competitive in the league now, which is really, really annoying. To, it's going to take me forever to get the top division. Um, but at least I can, like, you know, win the lower divisions maybe. But it's it's really pissing me off. It's going to take me forever to get in the top division in all CC now. But um, there you go. It is what it is. Yeah, I'm going to be in scrub tier, yeah. yeah. Um, Werewolves, uh, Necromantic, Jillio. I wish I'd gone Necromantic in, in UK BBL. I wish I'd just gone Necro in all of the leagues. Um, maybe Fish for Fat. I don't know what Rel G is. I've got no idea what Rel G is. Right. So, I can't hit Griff. 
Well, maybe I could. I could get three guard in here and then block him and then one dice him. But that doesn't seem sensible, does it? So I could just blitz this guy, who would be a blitz. So that makes sense. Block him first in case of a quad skull. No, good. It's done. Not good enough. Mm-hmm. Um... This is a bit, little bit, um, a little bit shy, isn't it? Because he has got, he has got the wizard chance at the moment. Pretty crap rolls. And I guess I'll leave him down. Rather than getting punched by Mighty Blow. And I guess I'll leave them guys there. Yeah, but the thing is, Niths, it means it does mean a lot. It does mean a lot. Because because I missed five games. Hello, Han Hans. Because I missed five games, now I'm relegated to being the fucking fourth tier at best or something. And it's like... It's just shit. It's just shit. It's just fucked me. Missing five games has cost me like 30 games to get to the top division, which is... Or 40 games to get to the top division. Which is really, really, really annoying because it's just going to take so many literal weeks of life to get to the to get to the top division. Um, so it's just crap, you know. If I if I just started five games before, I would have won my division probably, and uh, and then been you know in a, in in the in the um, in the running for it's just starting in the Premiership, but instead I've got no chance of getting the Premiership, no chance of getting in the first tier, no chance of getting in the second tier, no chance of getting in the third tier. So it, it's it's pretty annoying that I missed the first five games. I am pretty I am pretty pissed off that I missed the. Um, I missed those five games because I just basically didn't think of applying to OCC because I thought I was banned for life and then it turned out that I wasn't oh bonehead alright could, could blitz through here couldn't I make a breakthrough wouldn't mind that Stunned. I don't think I can pile on, can I? Because I want to get through. Though a little bit risky with the um, with this guy. I just didn't think of where I was going to go. To be quite honest, I've um, I've probably done goofed at this point. I didn't really think about where I was going to go afterwards. Um, I just thought, you know, I want to move forward a little bit. Um, which as it turns out probably isn't that good of a strategy is it if you can even call it that do I need to GFI to there probably not
think you can go there, that seems okay. And this guy too. Not here. Fuck it. I'm probably fucked right up here, but distracted thinking about OCC. Now he goes for the fireball. Ah, that's the GFI would have took me out of fireball range, which would have been good. So I guess the GFI 5 would have been good in in the end. Would have made the would have made the bolt less. Would have made the fireball less less devastating. But of course I could have double wand it, couldn't I? Um, he got a good he got a good removal from that though, didn't he? He um he removed my second best Y. Despite the fact that I've made um how many four five five mighty blow piling on hits and two or three mighty blow hits I haven't made removal and um, but the wizard's got that out but at least the wizard's gone so that's good yeah it's crazy isn't it Ravenpool Aurelensis is doing alright with a jump up but um, second best white equals worst white yeah Yeah, I guess now that the wizard's gone, I could score. But he's got he's got Griff, so I don't really want to score too early, do I? It's um, Griff makes it a bit interesting. You would think attrition would, but if if he gets if he gets a two turn even a two turn chance with Griff, he can just potato and, and score, can't he? It's not hard. It's not hard to potato score with Griff. Yeah, I think so as well. I think you've got to go for, you got to go for the Griff magic, the turn you whiz. Yeah, absolutely. Whiz, whiz and Griff combination is what you needed probably to win. But um, you never know. No, Nixon. Um, the OCC doesn't reset. It's it's re the divisions are kind of reset when the real thing starts. The divisions are set. It doesn't reset. But it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter if the teams were to reset. The point is, because I didn't play in the first five games, the highest I can do is like tier four or something, which is just stupid. It's really shit that missing five games has fucked me as much as missing like, you know, a hundred games. It really pisses me off, to be honest. I almost wish I hadn't entered that late, you know, because it's just, it's just pissing me off. It really pissed me off that I missed that first those first five games, if only I'd known, if only I'd known that I could have entered and knew when it was starting. I'm sure people probably said in chat when it was starting, but if I'd known about it and I'd entered it, season one, yeah, there you go, Jelly will tell me to sign up. But I did think I was banned. Um, I did think I was banned for life, but yeah, obviously I should have, I should have signed up and... Um, and just done that. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Cake or death. It's really, it's really bad for people who've missed the first five games. Really bad. A really, a really harsh system. Yeah, that's that's true, Jellio. Well, I don't hate him per se. I just hate that the effect he has on Blood Bowl. <laughs> this is. I'm in a bit of a fucking jam here, aren't I? Fucking. Players down. With well, this team is unexpected. Um, he could just block him, but he could blitz him, which would be nice. But then he's not armor. He's not armor. He's not armor seven like I like I expect him to be. So I'll just block. Oh god. So now he's got to blitz him. God, this is pretty, pretty horrible. In a pickle. In a pickle, indeed. Right, 
you can get in there, can't you? That seems good. Now you can 2D. Walk down with no balls. <laughs> Almost lost to a fucking breast team, I like that. Um Yeah, I, I, I don't mind the having to start behind the master. You know, that's the thing. I don't. I actually don't mind the starting behind. What I what I don't like is, it's going to take me so long to get to the premiership. Oh, that's the fucking annoying thing. It's going to take so long to get to the premiership, and like you know. Meanwhile, Sage will probably win the first three or four seasons and be like, "Look how good I am." And I'll be like, what a load of shit. <laughs> like, when, when OCC started, um, everyone was massive noobs in Blood Bowl 1, so Flicks from Fumble won, like, about the first five or six or seven seasons. Um, with Wood Elves and then, like... So, um, I'm pretty sure Sage is playing Woody's, yeah. Um... And like so, so because because Flix won like the first seven OCC seasons, Dode's like, Flix is an amazing coach. He's amazing. He's world class. He's the best coach in the world. And it's like, no, he was just better than all of the dross in that. Yeah, exactly. Cake or death. Now nowadays, obviously, there are there will be plenty of good coaches besides Sage. Yeah, of course. But you know, do you know what I mean? Though it is far from a given. Yeah, of course it is. He's he's not he's not that good. Then there are plenty. There's obviously plenty of decent coaches in OCC, but um, you know, like it was just funny how Dodd was like, because because he had won that, he was like, he's amazing, and he's just like, <laughs> I'm I do want to play for a long time, but I just don't want to. I don't want to be in the fucking shit tier divisions for a long time, CJ Blackburn. That's the problem. I just don't want to have no chance of winning the title for ages. 40 games or something. Please, I missed five games. I just think it's a little bit harsh. I just think... I just think it's a little bit harsh. That missing five games leads to 40 games to get the top flight or something, whatever it is. And that's if I win, the, win my division every single time, which obviously I might not. So... <laughs> Thank you, Nits. Make sure you're fouling. I'd, I'm not even sure Nergs are, are that good dropping clangers because that's what I mean. Because it was going to take me 40 games if I won my division every time. Nurgle, I wouldn't win my division every time. 100% guaranteed wouldn't win my division every time. Um, in fact, never mind, might not win. Would not win my division if I went with Nurgle. So I thought with Necro, I might. I'm, with Necro, I could. Um, I could go up as fast as I could with Necro and then also, you know, they'd be good in the long run as well. I mean, what do I do here? I'd like to get a Blitz in with him, wouldn't I? But can I do that? I might have to double GFI to Blitz with the Mummy. That frees up a zombie, but not that that achieves much. I think I have to G double GFI, and then he GFIs there so he can block him, and then power him, and then he blocks him. Double GFI Blitz with Mummy. I think if I reroll the first one, I don't make the hit. Alright, good. It's 
fucking grim this, isn't it? He's got to admit the GFI. This is really, this is going about as badly as it could have done, I think. The only thing going for me is that he, he failed to use his wizard. And I failed to use his wizard. His wizard failed to, well, it made a removal, but it failed to fuck me completely. <laughs> this is going horrible. I lost to humans with this team as well, I think. And it was basically exactly the same exactly the same thing. I just didn't didn't break armor at all. <laughs> So it might not take 40 games then. It might not take 40. Alright then, fair enough then. So I guess if I get... Um if I get double promoted a few times then. And maybe it's not so bad. But it was something like 37 games or whatever minimum is what it looked like. I can't remember now. I worked it out though. Maybe it was forty-three games or something like that. It was something outrageous. It was some kind of yeah. I think it was forty-three. I think it was thirty-six plus seven. So yeah, I think it was forty-three is what is what I was looking looking at being is what it should take. Which it's a lot of that's a lot of weeks to not, and that's that's even topping the group each time, which is it's far from guaranteed, isn't it? Yeah, this is this is how this is how my undead lost their lost one of their games. It was against humans, and just nothing nothing happened. Nothing happened at all like this. Apart from my guys getting stunned. Now my goo will one in nine and lose the game. I am I imagine. Yeah, Necro, Necro are a hard one if you're going to try to win the first season. That's the thing. They're not. They're a bit crap at a thousand. They're not. They're not. They're not ideal for a thousand Necro. Um, which is. Which is why I didn't take them in um, UK BBL. But. Um, I guess second or third is enough sometimes, Pizzle. But, you know, going as well as possible, that's what I meant, sorry. And yeah, maybe he's not winning my division. Going as well as possible each season would take me 43 games. Um, but I guess if there's if people re-roll and stuff. Yeah, Dark Hells are pretty good. But um, I think, yeah, I think uh, I think that's why I didn't go Necro and UK BBL, because I thought they wouldn't be that good in season one. Oh, fucking hell. Huge, huge pal that isn't it? Because otherwise I could have used him to spearhead and escape. And instead, I've got no escape. Um, God, this is fucked. <laughs> this is absolutely fucked. <laughs> Get banged on. Yeah, exactly, Jelly. That's the thing. It's the idiot. This is the thing. It was the necro, the necro with this bank rule. That's what's made. That's what's made me think necro are the best team in um, in Blood Bowl Two. Is the new bank rule? Is this is this stupid shit bank rule? Because I think. Um,
they they were always like the richest teams in in CRP. Um, we're, ne we're always necro, so they're not really suffering from this. No pile on now, can I? Shit that they're there there. If I stand him up, that'll be a 2D there. But still not good enough, is it? I guess he can stand up and make this one a 2D. And then follow, and then he can blitz out. That seems to be the best the best bet. Time for the time for the dodge. Dodge Fagors. Unbelievable, Jeff. Un fucking believable. One if it's a push, two, three, yeah, I've gotta I gotta go here so I can run away if it's a push. If it's a push. Oh, of course it's both down. Right, just two, just straight up two dies the ball then. I could have gone sideline. I didn't realise. Um, could I one, two, three, four, five, six? I could have gone sideline. Didn't realise I was um sidestep. One got one white got KO'd, Valene. And and these armor ten um, humans have had nothing happen to them. The new bank rule. Um, well, it's it's the it's the same rule that Blood Bowl Two has had since the start, but it's the new bank rule in for, for Blood Bowl Two. You know, it's new as in it's a year old, but as in it's the shitty Blood Bowl Two bank rule, um, which is new for Blood Bowl Two, which is, you know, the worst bank rule ever by a mile. Hello, it is as it is. Yeah. So it's not just it's not just the bank it's not just the bank rule, it's the shitty inducement system combined with the bank rule. Um and it's just awful. It's just absolutely awful. So on that basis, I think um That's why I think Necro are the best team in Blood Bowl too. Pals me bludger. For fuck's sake. I've got to go for the scatter, haven't I? And, and hope that Griff can't reach there. There. Wow. Dice to death. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 Hello darkness, my old friend. <laughs> yeah, exactly, cake of death, yeah. Yeah. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> What a game. What a fucking game. Dodge for no reason in amongst all that. Doesn't matter. He blocks him. Alright, we can still score here. Just need a pow here. No. Oh, no, that's not good, is it? Oh.
I've got to blitz him and then pick it up and score. Of course I want him now. How could I not want a 9 into injury? How could I not? How could I not want a 9 into injury? <laughs> oh, fuck me. I mean, I could have just powered him and then I could have moved 1, 2, 3, 4 and then straight up blasted Griff with Mighty Blow and then, you know, blitzed him and then scored. But instead, because, you know, obviously he's got Fend. So I could have just knocked him one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. So there's a chance there. Um, but there you go. <laughs> I was talking about sacking the ghoul earlier. <laughs> yeah, Jam Toast, I did, didn't I? I did start seeing how the team was. So now, now Cake or Death has got his wish, and uh, and <laughs> and the TV has been trimmed. <laughs> in fine in fine style wow wow <laughs> what a joke of it I can't believe I've lost a fucking humans twice with this team <laughs> fucking twice I've lost a humans with this team holy shit the worst fucking team in Blood Bowl probably probably worse than Bretts because at least have Bretts have Dauntless to hit the uh, mummies um wow wow it's just crazy and i haven't heard him at all <laughs> um oh, three ghouls all three ghouls injured and uh white killed from the fireball which is fair enough but um no i guess i guess brett's are worse because i my mummies would be knacking those peasants so, yeah, it does. It does seem like that, doesn't it, Cake or Death? It does feel like humans are just a worse. They're just like they've got nothing going for them against undead. Like obviously, you might be up Skaven more, and you know, and chaos. I guess obviously, a rookie chaos team would have been worse than rookie humans. Like bearing in mind, it is a rookie team. So as a as a rookie team, humans aren't the worst against undead because they do get griff. Whereas like chaos would have just got borak and and um, felt bad. Right. What can I do here? He has to make the pickup, doesn't he? One, two, three, four, GFI. And he needs to um he needs to pass it to um this white in the end zone here. He would go one. I can't make it, he's got a dodge pass griff. So it's looking looking tough to get the touchdown here. Alright, I'll I'll just I'll just one in eighty one anyway. Not into injury, unbelievably. Unbelievably not into an injury. <laughs> oh my god. No, I don't think Undead would be the one you wouldn't choose to play. I think it would be, it would be um, obviously 1500 Chaos could be worse because they could have a Claw Pommer. Or they could just have Elves and you've got no tackle. Um, I think an Elf team would definitely be harder to handle because if I don't break armor, then I've just got a, I've just got a Bash team. Bash teams are always going to be less good than um, Agility teams, aren't they? Right, looking, looking strong. Chance of a strong defence then. Eight players. Eight players. Let's fucking go. 
Stop fucking fighting everything! Ah! Fancy, fancy my chances here. <laughs> I mean, dwarves, you would rather not play face to 1500 dwarf team, would you? With a thousand TV team, I think, Kate Goddard. I think it's fair to say you wouldn't want to face a 1500 TV dwarf team with mass guard and mighty blow as a starting team. And that's probably the worst team you could possibly face as a starting team, as a 1500 TV dwarf team. But then at least you could, um, at least you could maybe win with a wizard somehow, with a wizard and griff. Whereas with elves, you, you don't even. I don't know, it's hard to say. Yeah, if he just rolls ones, I've got a chance, yeah. But he's got Griff. He's got Griff, so it's 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 tough to do anything, isn't it? Yeah, of course, Bizzle, you don't want to play any, you know, anything. Yeah, true, true. Well, it doesn't matter. It's just a game, innit? PG Pounds. And I never get salty about the actual games of Blood Bowl. I just get salty about the fucking who, who Cyanide call the community, which isn't the fucking community. It's some guys who run leagues who are completely out of touch with the actual community. That's what I that's what gets me riled up when it comes to Blood Bowl. Um but when it comes to the game it's just a game, isn't it? Yeah, don't have face dwarves ever. Yeah, that's true. That's true, I'd hire. Yeah, Blitz here would be alright, wouldn't it? But even then I've only got eight players, so a, a blitz ain't gonna do a lot. And that's the thing, once you're down players as undead, it's really bad. Because you've just got zombies, which are shitters, isn't it? So, so zombies are one of those teams where you, I probably should have maybe got the 13th player, but then I didn't want to take myself out of maybe getting a starting team there. Um, because the Mr. Mo Hacker, the rest of the team was also pimped out. <laughs> but they're all dead. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, uh, last game I lost. Um, I lost like a level four ghoul and a level three or four mummy, and um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. He does indeed, Bizzle. Yeah, he does indeed. <laughs> Good for us. And then he's like, we'll talk to the community and see what they think. All right. You'll talk to Dode. And if Dode, if Dode likes it, it'll happen. If Dode doesn't like it, it won't happen. Brilliant. Dode, the arbiter of truth. Fucking hell. It's a scary... This, this is what... This is what gets me salty just thinking about even thinking about this it probably is Omidon now yeah um, I was it was do it was going all right um, 15 wins and three losses was on track to I mean it, it, maybe if I play like you know I think I'll play out the 30 games with a team um, you know, but just for f more for fun rather than as a serious, a serious attempt at qualification. Um, you know, just because I, I do, I do actually like playing a few different games of like a few different teams with football. Um, like that's the thing. That's why I didn't want to play the first season. Of of um, yeah, I'll, I think I'll focus on the Nurgle as the first as the first. Nurgle or priority, and then, you know, if I want a break from the Nurgle, I'll use Undead or Necrory. I might even start a new Dark Elf team, because I can. It's not the end of the world to play something different than the one team. It doesn't actually hurt my qualification chances if I play a different team. Um, whereas in the... In the um, 30, 30 isn't the cutoff, but it's the point where it starts... It's it's not it's not a hard it's it's not um there's not a cut off but there is a bit of a fall it's a it's a fall away rather than a cut off um at that kind of tv 
Right, I've got to get him in, haven't I? And I've got to re-roll this, actually, to get him in. I've got four re-rolls. And he can blitz him right now. Could get a Kaz. Or a push. Or a push. I could, I could get a push. Like these guys, unfortunately, have to just get banged on now, don't they? But he can go in there, which is alright, isn't it? Kind of. Wish I had another three ghouls to put here. <laughs> yeah, I am Mr. Nice. Yeah, 30, 30 is... Yeah, there's diminishing returns for wins after 30. Yeah, that's it. So, um... So that's it. So, basically... If somebody's, like, got, you know, a 12-0 and record... You can beat them if you have um, a 30. You know, you, you can... I guess, yeah, there are there are dimension returns, but that's the point where, like, the, the graph really tails off after 30, basically. The graph really tails off after 30, so... It's still... It's still... You still get returns until... Until you play 114 or something. Yeah, it's just more significant after 30, yeah, sure. Sure. So I think basically a team that, that plays with a decent record with 30 games will do better than a team that plays with a decent game record with 12 games. You know? Um, I think. So I'm going to play 30 with my Nurgle. And I might play these up a little bit, but um, just for a change, because I can. It doesn't hurt, harm my chances of qualifying to play with a different team. I hated the first one where. Your your basically only chance to play to qualify you had to play every single game with the same team. That was the only way to qualify. It was an awful, awful system. It's it's shameful that anybody signed off on it. It's shameful that Dode suggested it and anybody agreed with it. Unbelievable. It's so bad. It was so bad the first season. So fucking bad. Um but now that that's uh, <laughs> now that it's not so bad now, I don't think it's good now. But it's not as bad as it was because at least I can play different teams. Yeah, yeah. I, w I would say your thirties about is about where you want to stop. Prize. Or like, you know, 28. If your team's good and you play 28, then it's a good time to stop or whatever, isn't it, you know? But I would say around 30. If you play around 30 games and you get the team, like, if this team, if I had, um... Oh, yeah, and just stop playing them when you get the top spot as well. That's the other way to do it as well, as Bizzle says. Just keep them top. Um, but then, obviously, someone might make, a, might make a late charge and get you. Orca Cola Cup Squirrel Dude. VIP Squirrel Fagors. <laughs> um, Orca Cola Championship. Yeah, that's it. Championship because for some reason they have the championship as the top division, not the premiership, which um, I think sucks. Personally, I would have the cha I would have the premiership. And then it'd be OCP, which would be... Um, is, is OCP in, in Robocop? That'd be even better, wouldn't it? Was it was OCP in Robok? It was OCP. That would be that would be tons better if it was OCP. Um. I've got to get my um. I've got to get my uh, white in a position to um. To get Griff, haven't I? Which is maybe blitzing with him. Yeah. 
He's just got to get a man in. I guess I could blitz with him. Yeah, I guess that's what I've got to do. Right, he can block. is this match <laughs> holy shit <laughs> it's outrageous isn't it yeah <laughs> yeah i'm getting absolutely ruined ruined um yeah yeah god ocp robocop yeah fucking hell could you imagine that could you imagine that ocp being the Orca Cola Premiership would have been much better, and then you could have just had like a robotic orc as the um as the picture, and it oh yeah Griff fuck off, <laughs> and they could have had like a, a robo robo orc, and that'd be pretty cool. Yep. <laughs> oh god, against against rookie humans. Oh man, one mighty blow on the 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 orc hasn't even done anything either. Two one in eighty ones from mummies, one of which cast himself. Fucking hell. Yeah, it's an actual rookie human team, is it is as it is. Yeah, the old cyborg orc, orc yeah. 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 <laughs> that would be alright. Minus, minus two D on Griff. That's what I need to do. He's in range. One, two, three, four, five, six. Unless he blitzes him, he's go he's going for the fucking dodges and uh I don't know, five plus dodge. Five plus four plus three plus uphill blitz. Oh, oh shit, now he's gonna bang on him with a ogre probably, isn't he? No he hasn't. He's in range. He's in range, isn't he? One, one, two, three, four, five, six. No, one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. He's in range. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. GFI. He can do it. Wow! I can't believe. Can't believe my guy didn't die then. I literally cannot believe it. Maybe I should just block with him or blitz and then move him around to um because I could maybe draw still. If I can force the score. Holy shit, got a knockdown. I'm not in range to blitz Griff though. So two GFIs. Alright, good. Um but the thing is you've got limited concessions, Papa Piccolo. So um so the you know <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, Fash. <laughs> yeah, Fash, I remember. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, if I concede, then... Um, then it counts for my, my concession limit, and there's no real... There's no real point, is it? I'll just, just waste a bit of time. It's not the end of the world waste a little bit of time but um 
Yeah, cheeky look at the Kaz boxes. Let's have a look here. The humans getting Mighty Blow piling on um, about 10 times in the match. I've got and Mighty Blow quite a few times. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> the rookie humans, 500 TV disadvantage, <laughs> have made uh, killed a ghoul. Oh, bro, stun, stunned him straight away there as well. Um, Kill the ghoul, Kaz to others, minus movement at a uh, mummy there, and KO'd him, who failed to recover. Um, yeah. Brutal. Brutal. Yeah, Dead Fantastic. This isn't Dead Fantastic, this is Undead Champions. Dead Fantastic are actually, actually alive and well, because Dead Fantastic is the UK BBL team. Um... <laughs> yeah, I said he said he said he was he was a lovely guy, and he was like um, he was like I, I've learnt loads from you, and I was like you've certainly learnt a lot better dice than me. <laughs> he has, he has indeed. Um, on oh, minus AV, I knew it was a death. The good thing is my UKBBL guy. Um, yeah, the humans have been mighty pushing more than mighty blow. That's very true. That's very true, Cat Vilma. Um, it's funny because my UK BBL one's got a minus movement ghoul, but I think I'm not going to sack him because looking at Schaefer's TV, he's 1450 or something. And my next game is against. Um, is against. Norse. So I think I probably don't even want four ghouls against them. So I think what I'll do is I'll keep my, my movement busted ghoul. Um, at least for one game in in that in that in that league. Wait. Get banged on. Ho oh. ho. Ho 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 eh? We're unbeatable now, boys. Un. Beatable. And another one. Armor breaks. Armor breaks coming out of my ass. Both down. No problem. Look at Kaz, well done, noob. Look at noob. <laughs> new humans. Just go new humans, Valene, and get matched against 1500 undead and do this. <laughs> Give them a apparent power level in this game, yeah. Yeah, now I'll have a fair representation of ones and skulls. Yeah, exactly, fish for fat. That's how crazy it is. That is basically how crazy it is. Yeah, and I, and I bet the dice will be pretty even. I have, I mean, I had, I did pile on. I did pile on five times in the first three turns, um, so that the the dice have to be at least, at least vaguely, bad. And I made a few stuns. I mean, I was making stuns, but I was just piling on them and not improving them, um, which obviously was detrimental to my positioning. So like that is the bad thing when you when you do pile on and, and don't make any headway. Um But I feel I still think it's right to pile on nearly every time. There's gotta be a good reason to not pile on rather than a good reason to pile on. Oh, Sunday afternoon blood ball. I didn't. I didn't know that was a thing. Um, VIP scroll, dude. But um, oh yeah, Sunday afternoon blood ball. I didn't even realise. Isn't that crazy? No, I, this is just one game before I go out. I'm gonna, gonna, I'm going out after this game. So I just thought I'd have a little bit of depression before something nice happens. <laughs> Right, 
This doesn't look that bad now, actually. Like, obviously it looks horrific. But it doesn't look that bad, does it? One GFI to get him in there. I could have even gone that way, that would have been better, wouldn't it? Get him. Got him. Duh. Injury. Yep. Yep. Good. Ones and skulls. Telling me the dice are fair. <laughs> um... Yeah, five times in three turns. Which is brutal, isn't it? I mean, like, like he didn't even get to limit my blitzes and stuff. Remember a week ago when Jimmy won a game of blood ball? I won last night, Flashfinder. I, I won I won the... Um, and I won in the UK PBL as well. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's just sniping in terms of getting the match. That's it, isn't it? Sniping in terms of just getting matched up against them. Um... Obviously not. Yeah, no. Um. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> um. Yeah. So, sniping is just is just to get the match, isn't it? That's that's the only thing about the sniping. That's what sniping is. People mistake ghosting for sniping. Right, I see Crumsley. VIP Crumsley. No, it's not, is it? Is it? Can't even remember. Admin bod Crumsley. There you go. Ghosting is when you're watching someone to get an advantage. Right. Right. So sniping is just getting matched against them. And to be fair, it does... <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you. I'll tell you how it can be an advantage. It is as it is, <laughs> because because it's getting somebody to help you, isn't it? Really, by watching. Because if you were watching my UK BBL match last night, I was on Discord with the with the guy I was playing, and um, I was like. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, uh, oh, he's, he's fucked up there, moving that guy. And then he was in Discord with me, so he just moves him back. <laughs> I'm like, whoops, <laughs> whoops, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Um, right, this is an easy six plus dodge now, isn't it? Um, I think, or do I just go, oh no, I can make two three pluses. So one, two, three, four, five, six. A three, two, two is easier, isn't it? And uh, do I want to do the block first? No, I want to make sure I've got the reroll for this. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Well done, Bizzle. Yeah, that's exactly true. Yeah, if you know what you're target playing, you can pick a team that gives you a huge advantage, yeah. For example, Rookie Humes against 1500 Undead. <laughs> this is like no game of Blood Bowl I've ever witnessed, apart from the other time this team lost to humans with a massive TV advantage. <laughs> it's just crazy. I don't get it. I'm not Because I didn't even take it easy. 
Like maybe a, maybe both games are piled on a little too much. Maybe. But I don't think I took them easy. I just failed that one in well I failed the blitz, didn't I? The blitz that would have um gave my ball carrier some protection. But even then I just it was just hard not make making no removals and his wizard getting a removal and stuff. It was I don't like I do tend against humans, I do tend to play a little bit shit against humans because like I feel that they can't do anything. And um I have a tendency to take it a bit easier in games that I think I should win. And obviously 1500 TV undead against um against humans is one of those games where I think I'm gonna win. So I, I could have definitely taken it a bit easy. But um But I, I I don't think I've played really stupidly, I just think it's been pretty unlucky. Yeah, the Nurgle Pro brings a bell to me as well. Yeah. Oh yeah, the Dwarf versus Dark Elf. Yeah, that was really funny, wasn't it? That was really funny. Yeah. Fucking hell. Well, he was a love. He was a lovely fella. And he'll be able to have a good laugh at when he watches this on YouTube, won't he? <laughs> Fucking hell. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> what a game. What a fucking game. Holy shit. I guess it was better to have this with the face cam and everything with his team than having these dice with my... Uh... Funnily enough, if I'd activated my try-hard Necros, it would have... Um, it would have been... It would have been literally the same matchup if, I, if I'd activated my try-hard Necros. Um, which would have been a better team to have taken the loss on, I think. But... There you go, it is It is what it is, isn't it? Holy shit. Holy shit. I can't actually believe it. I can't actually believe it. What a crazy match. Kill the last one. I can't even attempt a one turn, can I? Because I've got, <laughs> I haven't got enough players. I haven't got any movement seven. <laughs> oh, fuck it, reroll. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> What's even happening? I don't understand. Oh yeah, he just gets the he just gets the fucking pow. He'll foul. I haven't seen him in the foul, I don't think. <laughs> oh man. Um holy shit. See you, dude. Fucking hell. <laughs> what a lovely, what a lovely chap. Fucking hell. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, I, lo I love the white pylon. That's crazy. <laughs> it should be smooth sailing from here on. What a cra Even on the last turn, there were just two pylons for nothing. Unbelievable. And see, I made 14 armor breaks. That makes the dice look fair, doesn't it? 14 AV breaks, one KO, two injuries. Um, and so I got a lot of stuns. So I shouldn't, I shouldn't actually be complaining that much, I guess. He made 10 AV breaks into three cars, but um, there were four cars. There were five cars that were inflicted total. I suffered five cars, even though this only says three. Um. Griff MVP can't can't argue with that, can you? He he certainly he certainly was. He scored and he was MVP. Just part of Nuffles' whimsy that um, him losing his MVP there. Right, so let's let's get rid of Weeksy. Let's get rid of um. Oh no, he's just missed next game. That's all right. Oh yeah, I don't need to sack the other girl. He just died. He just straight up died. Um, he can go block. What what does this mummy look like? He's got the open face. So this one can have this. Do you know what? I can have the tiger. He's back. And, um... Right. And I don't have enough for another ghoul. One ghoul with wrestle in the next match. Five... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A journeyman, in fact, for the next match. Wow. Yeah, that is true. That is true, Jam Toast. I did, I did, I did say as I was doing it. I don't really have a plan here, and I did get me in a bad place in that. Yeah, so it was. I did fuck it up. You're quite right, Jam Toast. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Tomo five five thousand. But yeah, I did just I did just say I did. I've got no real idea. I've got no real idea what I'm doing here. Um, I I did I did I did do a crazy move forward, um, without really thinking it through, and then it did snowball from there. That's a very good point. Um, so yeah. But God, it's, I still didn't deserve this though, did I? <laughs> I didn't deserve my whole team to die, and I could have got out of it as well. I just didn't. And I just didn't think it through. It wasn't. It wasn't like a crazy move. I don't think it was that bad a bad a move when I went through there. And like obviously the the wizard getting the removal made things worse. But um, yeah, I didn't. I didn't really think much about it. Um, to be honest, but and, and obviously did get did get punished. I mean, at least at least thank God. Aurelensis regenerated because if he hadn't regenerated it would have really been it would have really been game over for this team. But I could no I can't really get rid of a reroll. I don't have a ball handler now. So down to twelve forty TV, which is what Keiko Death recommended I get down to. Um I would have rather not have everyone die to do it. <laughs> but there you go. Now it looks like I'm journeyman abusing as well, because I'm using a journeyman for next match. Um crazy. Fucking humans giving us the fourth loss there. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.